It's August 8th, 2017. I'm on my way to visit Bridge North Town, which is one of the most spectacular inland town settings in England. Arriving in Bridge North, I first head down to see some ducks under the Bridge North Bridge. Bridge North Bridge is a great spot for taking pictures. It's adorned with a colourful array of flowers and has a great view of the High Town, which we'll be visiting shortly. There is a lot of spectacular architecture here. This Elizabethan manor house is one of the oldest buildings in Bridge North. It was originally known as Foster's Folly and was built from oak posts and beams believed to have been salvaged from old ships. It's time to take a ride on the Castle Hill Railway, which is the steepest and only in a railway of its type in England. This railway has been transporting the people of Bridge North up and down the 111 foot sandstone cliffs that separate the High Town from Low Town since its opening on the 7th of July 1892. It's only a short journey, but I always feel it's a well worth it experience. Having arrived at the top of the cliff, you'll find a beautifully drawn map of Bridge North Town. Now let's head over to St Mary's Church and the castle. Don't forget to check out the spectacular views of the valley and low town from up here. Even Charles I declared this view to be the finest in all his kingdom. I don't know if any of you like watching anime, but this place always reminds me of Kiki's Delivery Service. What do you guys think? building was designed by Thomas Telford. Heading over to Bridge North Castle.
idea to get out of the sun. Time to check out the town centre. Wow, I love this post box. That's the Town Hall, next to which you'll find the entrance to the Bridge North Indoor Market, which is very small but worth a quick look. Bridge North is full of small quirky shops. There's also an old terrace sweet shop, which is full of traditional British sweets. As a kid, these pineapple cubes were my favourite. Just about to head back down on the cliff for a
I may have just spotted a queen bee here and honestly it was so bougie. I'm really freaking out. Let me show you the footage. So yeah, here are just some normal bees, wasps and the like. And then, oh my god, like how big is that? I swear it was like the size of my thumb. But yeah, let's get back to the beauty that is original. I love how the UK always makes good use of our iconic red telephone boxes and this one is extra special because it's for a defibrillator. It's actually the only one of its kind I've ever seen. So guys, let me know if you've ever seen one of these anywhere else in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to continue following me on my next adventure. Bye bye!